Welcome to Web Chef. And today I'm going to show you how easy it is to cook and prepare some fresh crabs. You want to get the biggest pot you have in the house and fill it up halfway with some water and throw in some sea salt and bring it to a boil. Throw all your crabs in and we're going to cook them for about uh, 15 minutes. Let's get the lid on and uh, bring it to a boil on high heat. When your pot comes to a boil, uh, bring it down to about uh, under medium high heat and let your uh, crabs cook for the remaining 15 minutes. The crabs are cooked now and uh, we're going to get them out of the pot and get them under some uh, cold water. Wow, these look delicious. I'm looking forward to cracking into these. I'm going to get these under some cold water and I'm going to show you how to prepare them for your meal. A beautiful bright orange cooked crab. We're going to remove the apron. Pour it right out. Next we're going to uh, break half the body from the shell and uh, here's the mouth and we're going to crack it right along the, the middle of the body so you grab it by the legs and pry it up from its shell. We're going to remove the mouth now just grab it and break it off and then we have our lungs and just pull everything off any loose debris just pull it off and pull the lungs off and while you're doing this rinse it under some cold water while you're doing this because it helps remove some of the uh, uh, tamale that's in your uh, shell here. So give it a good rinse. There's some sweet crab meat inside this white shell part of the crab. Right in there. There you go. Let's go get our uh, second half. We want to pry the body away from the shell. So just grab it by the legs and pull up. I'm going to show you the tamale. Some people like to eat it. I prefer lobster tamale. Let's get back to the second half here and remove the debris. I'm going to remove the mouth and then the uh, lungs. Just pry them right off, rip them off. Find anything loose and just pull it off and then give it a good rinse. There's still a little bit of tamale embedded in the meat, but that's fine. We'll just add more flavors. Melt yourself some butter or some uh, garlic butter. Get yourself a pair of kitchen shears or a nutcracker to crack open the shells on these crabs and get ready to enjoy some mouth-watering sweet snow crab meat.